Hello everyone, happy Pi Day. In this video, we're going to be solving an exponential equation. Let's get to work. I'm going to go ahead and natural log both sides. And that's going to bring the exponents down. In this case, we're going to get e to the x ln pi equals pi to the x ln e. As you know, ln e is equal to 1, so we can go ahead and forget about it because it's 1. And this gives us e to the x ln pi equals pi to the power x. Now let's go ahead and divide both sides by e to the x to bring the x's together. That's actually going to give us pi over e to the power x equals ln pi. I just used the common base, I mean common exponent. And now we're going to go ahead and natural log both sides one more time because our goal is to bring the x down whenever x is in the exponent we should use logs and in this case i'm using natural log which is ln okay now when we ln both sides one more time this x we're gonna bring that to the front x times ln pi over e is gonna be ln ln pi so double ln okay and finally almost finally to get x by itself, we're going to go ahead and divide both sides by ln pi over e. That's going to give us ln ln pi over ln pi over e. As you know, ln pi over e can actually be split up into a difference. So we can write it as ln pi minus ln e. And as you know, ln e is 1, right? We just talked about it. So we can actually write x as ln ln pi divided by ln pi minus 1. So that should be the answer for this problem, right? Obviously. Uh, but there is more than one way to write it, obviously. You could also use different bases. For example, we could start with the same problem, but log both sides, just base 10. We could even use base pi. I guess it would be really cool to use base pi, and you can definitely try that because today is pi day, right? Okay, great. So that's basically the answer. Let's go ahead and take a look at some numerical value uh, that I got from Wolfram Alpha and try to guess at this point what X is going to look like numerically and see if you guessed it right. Okay, here we go. So the numerical value for this equation is supposed to be 0 0.933938. So that's basically, it's pretty close to 1, right? Don't you think so? ln pi minus 1 is approximately ln ln pi you can pretty much say that right and again like i said earlier you can definitely go ahead and log both sides you could even use base pi because that's a valid base remember for a base to be valid it has to be greater than one and you know different from one and greater than zero anyways this brings us to the end of this video thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it. please let me know don't forget to comment like and subscribe i'll see you next time with another video until then be safe take care and bye bye